I'm JSD, and welcome to the Minecraft Quarantine Education Edition series, where I go through worlds and just criticize them, basically. And we're on Fun with Fractals, and by the looks of it, it's really cool. So we spawn here, and let's check out what's going on. Instructions. I've already read those. I'll let you guys read. So, so here you generate you fractals, block yeah, and you get cores from there. So, uh, so here you can put any shape, and depending on if there's quartz blocks or not, it will place that shape in there. Let me give you an example. So I created this really ugly shape, and in order to transfer it, you, I think you click this. Ooh. A lot of lag. And see, for every quartz block, you get the same shape. It's pretty cool, but that's not the only cool thing in this world. This world is just pretty amazing, actually. They have a gigantic Mendelbrot set, because if you don't know, that's the most famous fractal. The clouds are in the way. That's that's a really rip. Also, they have it in the sky, some fractal-looking thing. I've been probably going in circles for a while now. I can't find anything. Uh, it's so big. Um, turning cords on would like put like cheats into this, which makes really no sense because you're already in creative mode. Uh, I'm still looking. Um, but this world is just really nice to explore, I mean, not really much point in doing it, just more just building the fractal itself. Uh, but the rest of it's cool, there's a lot, there's, well not a lot, but there's more stuff that I can't find because I'm obviously lost. Yeah, I kind of give up. Um, I don't know where the, those other things are, but um, this world is just a strange like maze because everything looks the same. You can't like really find a specific landmark, and because fractals are fractals, they kind of repeat a few of the same things in like other parts of the world. So, see, like that's not the first mental broth set I've passed by. Like that's like probably the third one. Yeah, so overall, this world's pretty cool. Um, just probably if they could have done something with the chords. Um, I think you can turn that on. I mean, it's fine if you don't, but I recommend turning them on. And yeah, there's, there's pretty cool designs they have in this world. Um, besides those other building platforms. So I finally decided to turn on cords, but I didn't even use the cords for anything. Um, I, th I found some stuff. Finally. Looks like this is made of glass. Maybe if they could have made it quartz, it would be easier to see. Uh, doesn't really look like there's much. Okay, that's the glass structure in the, in the center. And this is the main Mendelbrot set. Yeah. The one that takes probably over my render distance to load in. Yes, I'm starting to find stuff. Okay, what is this? Oh, yep, that's the structure. Here's another platform you can do it on. Yep. But this one's like a, I think an even bigger version of that. Like, so how does this one work? Oh, this one just does a fractal. 
so it makes fractals in there by default and then it just looks like yeah it just yeah What's that? I don't know what this is supposed to be, but... Mm. This one's pretty cool. Um, I guess that's about it for this world. I wish I could have showed you more. Just, yeah, just me getting lost and stuff. But like and subscribe as always, and I'll see you in the next video in the series. Goodbye.